the Indian Army is still nowhere near getting desperately needed modern helicopters. Howitzers and air defense weapons. Or even new assault rifles and carbines to plug its critical operational deficiencies. But its infantry soldiers are now finally poised to get some basic protection gear after decades of neglect. Defense Ministry sources on Monday said a contract for one 58,279 lightweight ballistic helmets, worth around 170 crore rupees, is on the anvil now. The deal would have been inked much earlier after the CNC contract negotiation committee was completed. But there has been a complaint, as also some financial queries. Dot. Dot. These are now being addressed, said a source. If the contract for the new helmets is indeed inked, it will be the second such deal to ensure better personal protection for infantry soldiers, who are often forgotten in the clamor for sophisticated weapon systems. As was first reported by Toy in March, the army had inked the 140 crore rupees contract for emergency procurement of 50. 000 new bulletproof jackets from Tata Advanced Materials Limited after a delay of over a decade. Similarly, the proposed purchase of the ballistic helmets with 13mm trauma protection pads is slated to take place from an Indian manufacturer MKU. The helmets for commanders will also be equipped with integrated communication headsets. The Army has been demanding lightweight ballistic helmets for almost two decades now because the existing ones are not only bulky, but also provide protection from only splinters and rocks. Head injuries are a major problem in both conventional as well as counter-insurgency operations. We want ballistic helmets that can stop 9mm bullets from around 20 meters. It should also be possible to mount night vision sights protective goggles and other devices on them, said a senior officer. Such helmets would be a great morale booster for soldiers who make go with old, heavy helmets that only give limited protection to the top of heads and not the sides, he added. Consequently, soldiers generally prefer to use the lighter bulletproof patcast during counter-insurgency operations. But they too weigh around too. 5 kilograms and protect only the forehead and the back of the head, said another officer. In contrast, soldiers in advanced countries wear ultralight helmets made of high-tenacity copper.